What is up, film geeks, and welcome to my channel. Today, we are talking about the brand new Sam Mendes movie, 1917, and this movie has had all the buzz. It's going to win all the awards. It won big at the Golden Globes. My hype has been an all-time high for this movie. Did it live up to the hype? Well, let's find out. Before we give you guys my thoughts, go ahead and join me in the comment section. Share your guys' take on this film. Did you love it? Did you hate it? Did it live up to your expectations? Did it live up to all the hype that has been surrounding it? And let's get into 1917. And my favorite part about this film is what Sam Mendes tried to do with the one take. Obviously, the whole movie wasn't one take. There was definitely a couple cuts in there, but that one take, how we got to experience everything with the soldiers, whether it's just them sleeping by a tree, walking through the mosh pit of all their guys, walking through no man's land, everything we got to experience with them was glorious. We literally got to feel as if we we're there with them, not just a bystander watching a movie. It literally felt like it was in place, 1917, World War One, with these two characters. When they would look down, you were looking down with them. When they're looking at a map, you're looking at the map with them. The overall direction of this film was bloody fantastic. I loved everything Sam Mendes did, the shot selection. The cinematography is easily gonna win an Oscar. If it doesn't, then the Academy has just lost their minds. And even the score, it wasn't too haunting, but it just felt right in every moment. Whenever the score is playing, you're like, you're either getting chills, you're thinking something bad's going to happen. And what Sam Mendes did really well is he created tension. When we're walking and crawling through no man's land, when all the other troops have left, when you're walking and crawling with them, you feel like something's going to happen. You feel as if they're going to get shot at. You feel every nerve that they feel. You are there with them. It is an experience I have not experienced in a theater. Nothing to where I felt as if I was with these two soldiers the entire time. The performances are extremely getting overlooked and the emotional tie we get to these characters, we're rooting for them. We look at them as they're our comrades. We're looking at them as if they are our brothers. And that's what this movie did so well is it has made us relate to them and it put us in their shoes and we went on this journey in World War One. What a crazy time. What a crazy ass movie. 1917 is overall best made movie I've seen of the 2019 year. Because this did come out in 2019, but it's the best overall made movie. It's not my favorite. It might not even be my favorite war movie, but I think it's the best overall made movie. And I think San Mendes is going to win the Best Director Award. If he doesn't, he's at least going to get nominated. But 1917 is a masterpiece. Comment your guys' thoughts down below on the brand new movie 1917. Did you love it? Did you hate it? Are you somewhere in between that live up to your expectations? Comment those guys down below. Later on, I'm going to have a review for Just Mercy. So make sure you guys are here for that. Do me a favor and go see a movie. And I'll see you guys next time.